Okay, um, let's imagine that this is a piece of paper or a big flip where we are writing the proposal that our circle, finance, is going to make. We are creating a proposal in our circle, and five minutes later or else um, in the next uh, uh, meeting that we have, we're going to consider the proposal. Okay. Um, we're writing here that we do this. So I'll imagine that's the words of the proposal. And what we add into the proposal are the ways that we will later, once we have implemented it, measure it. How much, how many. Measure it for what? How well is it doing what our intention is for that proposal? And our intention for that proposal fits within the aims of our finance circle. So here are some ways we're going to measure it. And here are some ways we're going to evaluate it. What's the difference? Measuring is specific and concrete and is generally how much, how many, and quite often results in uh, data that we get from a survey or a poll or data that is numerical. Some people call this metrics, but I don't want to sound like a business person here in our workshop. Metrics. Okay. And then we also write into this proposal the dates of upcoming meetings where we are going to consider the measurements that we made and do the evaluation. What's evaluation? It's, a, it's subjective. Do I like it? Do we like it? Is it working well? What seems to be not working well? Anything we want to change. So I'm going to put some dates. Let's say we're meeting in June and we have a meeting months and months. So we're going to have our July meeting, our August meeting, and our October meeting. Each time we measure and evaluate it in the future, the proposal that we um, consented to in our meeting today, we can change how we measure and evaluate it, and we can change these dates. Why? Because we're adjusting ourselves to real life, to reality, to what we actually learned. That's what feedback loops are. We could also call it continuous improvement. Can you see how, if we create a proposal and we implement it, and then we measure and evaluate it, and then we have three choices. The three choices are, we can keep it as it is, we can change it, or we can throw it out. Wait, some things you can't throw out, and you can't change, because once you do it, you've done it. That's right, some things are like that. But the policies that guide our work, for our work tasks in our circle, are things we can adjust. Projects that we create that we want to alter as we're learning more about how it's turning out, we can often adjust. Fixing the roof, we can't adjust because we want the roof to stay fixed. Building a new building, hmm. We can measure and evaluate it so we have data for the next time we build a building. So this is built into sociocracy. Feedback loops, otherwise known as continuous improvements. Thank you.